Hello friends, I'm going to share with you more secrets about Hanukkah, the wonderful holiday of Hanukkah, and today specifically about removing blockages. If we stuck somewhere in life, if we are not uh, moving forward, any kind of limitations can be removed by the light of Hanukkah. Eight days of Hanukkah providing us with enough miraculous energy to overcome and remove blockages. So within the word Hanukkah, we have the name Hannah, Hannah. Hannah was the mother of Shemuel Navi, Samuel the prophet. So I'm going to focus specifically on one aspect, one specific aspect from the life story of Hannah, of Hannah. She was married to a man named Elkanah. Elkanah had two wives. Back then it wasn't that abnormal, I guess. One wife, her name was Penina, and she gave birth to kids. Elkanah, of course, was very happy with her. Hannah, the other wife, couldn't have any kids. She was barren. And to make things even worse, Penina, the one that was able to have kids, Penina was making fun of her, mocking her, putting her down, and basically just making fun of her every day. Hannah was probably in tremendous amount of pain, frustration, and she was praying a lot. She was praying, meditate a lot to have kids. And eventually her prayers, her meditations worked out and she gave birth to Samuel, Samuel the prophet, Shmuel Anavi. What was so powerful about Samuel the prophet? He was the one that together with King David established and built the human connection, the human connection of human souls to a reality that is called Netzach. What is the reality of Netzach? Netzach in Hebrew means victory, triumph, and eternity. Let's see it directly from the Zohar. It's the Zohar of Bereshit A, paragraph 145. Let's read it in Aramaic and in English. ולא התנבא ברנש מתאמן עד דעתה שמואל ועל דע נצח ישראל כתיב ב כי לא אדם הוא. No man prophesied from there until שמואל who firmly established the ספירה of נצח. Now let's put it all together. Within the word Hanukkah we have Hannah, Hannah the prophetist. that was barren, couldn't have kids. She knew how to use this energy of Hanukkah to remove the blockage. We are not talking only about being barren and not being fruitful in case of, uh, again, having kids, but any area of our lives where we feel stuck, we feel there is some kind of a blockage, things are not moving forward. During the time of Hanukkah, Hannah, the prophetess, is a, she is a great channel of removing those blockages from every area of our lives. Not only that, but the, the son that she brings to this world, Shmuel, Samuel the prophet, is establishing the connection with certainty, certainty of victory, knowing that every challenge that we are facing Either it's a challenge or again, we are stuck somewhere, a blockage that we might be experiencing. The combination of Hannah and her son, Samuel the prophet, that together with King David is channeling in Hanukkah, that energy of certainty and that energy of becoming victorious against the challenges, challenges and blockages that we have in our lives.
So enjoy the energy of that powerful holiday and the great impact that Hanukkah will have on our lives. See you next time in the next video.